So, principles of isolating a single colony, a single species of bacteria from a mixed culture. Mm -hmm. So, you've grown the mixed culture in a liquid medium like this. Yeah. So you've taken a swab from, you know, a sink, a toilet, a cup, whatever. Yeah. You've grown it in this mixed medium. The medium contains source of carbon, so glucose, source of amino acids, phosphate, um, all, all things to make, make stuff grow. Yeah. You take your loop, uh -huh. the wire loop, you heat sterilize it, you stick it in a Bunsen burner. Yeah. You get that wire loop, you dip it into here, and that will give you a ring of a small amount of bacteria. Yeah. Now these bacteria will be on this loop. What you're then going to do, you're going to take that loop and you're going to spread it onto the plate. Now, once you've spread it, you're going to, it, when it cultures overnight, it's going to give you a big thick line because it's going to be confluent growth because there's millions and millions and millions and millions of bacteria in that sample and you've spread it out so it's big thick line then you having d done this once you heat sterilize it again and that's the important point because when you heat sterilize it again when you push it through that loop through you'll be picking up just the bacteria in that junction and then spreading them out again. Then, and that's where students miss the point, then you heat sterilize this again, then you apply the loop and you put it back just through the end of the line. So you've spread the bacteria out one way, then you spread them out again another way, each time the inoculum there's less and less because you're just picking it up from each junction here yeah. and here yeah. then the final step is that you heat sterilize this again so you're getting the remnants of the bacteria off and then you spread it through but what you see this time is there are so few bacteria at this point that when you spread it through you get single colonies growing. Now each one of these single colonies is the result of a single bacteria dividing. Yeah. So this is a colony which is genetically identical therefore it's all one species. So this is how you isolate one species from a mixture of bacteria because you've spread it out through doing the streak plating to get such a low population density that eventually you get a single blob and each one of these blobs is a single bacteria. As, uh, sorry, is a colony that's come from a single bacteria that's divided by binary fission. So it's visible because this is now millions of bacteria because it's divided by binary fission. However, each one comes from a single bacteria that's divided and divided and divided, therefore it's genetically identical it's the same species. You can then scrape off that colony and then culture it in a liquid medium and create a single culture of a single species. Yeah. Okay.